Hi everybody, welcome to Core and More with Coach Doug O. Today we're going to be doing a beginner ab workout. No equipment is needed. Do what you can. Most of the exercises are beginner. However, if there's something that you can't do, I just want you to try your best or do something that you can. Our exercise will be 30 seconds of active work with a 10 second break. It should take about less than eight minutes to complete our workout. So with that being said, let's get into position. You'll need your mat. If you want to play some music, feel free. Otherwise, we're going to start off with a front crunch. Once again, 30 seconds, chin up, and here we go. Remember when you're coming up, you want to breathe out. Breathe it out. Keep the chin up. We'll just be doing one exercise per 30 seconds. We won't be doing any sets. Okay, next we are going to be doing a side crunch. Knees to the left side, crunch it up. Knees together. We're going to be doing the right side and then the left side. Now I'm not getting very far off the ground, but that's all you need to do. Now let's switch over to the other side. Once again, shoulders are kind of back, looking straight up. Remember to breathe. Looking good, everybody. Nice work. Keep pushing. Okay, lay it on your backside. We're going to do a heel touch side to side, right and left. And shoulder blades up. And reach side to side. Keep that chin up. When we look down, our, our neck goes down, so keep your chin up. Keep it out of your chest. Pretend you have a tennis ball between your chest and your neck. And your chin. Reach as far as you can, whether that's the back of your calf, the back of your shoe. From here, we're going to do an ab hold. Okay. Legs are going to be up and out on an angle. Hands are down. Lift your upper body off the ground a little bit. I just hold it here. Remember to breathe. Just get angle your feet down a little bit if you want to make it harder. Still get those shoulder blades off the ground. Keep it nice and tight right here. Doesn't matter if your hands are up or down. Relax. From here, we're going to go to flutter kicks. So support your lower back. Point your toes away and kick. Ankles are higher than your knees. Chin is up. Look at the wall or look at the ceiling. Remember, if there's something you can't do, take a little break or try something that you can do. Okay, we're going to bring yourself up to a seated position. We're going to do a Russian twist, which is be touching side to side. And go. Now, hopefully with the little bit of break that I give you, you're keeping constant tension on your core. Now, I'm leaning back just a little bit. Touching side to side. 
If you want to bring your feet off the ground, you can. That'll make it a little bit harder because of instability. Otherwise, you're just touching. From here, we're going to lay it back onto our backside. Toe touches. Now, whether that's reaching for your toes, shins, ankles, knees, breathe on the way up. Keep breathing. Okay, from here we're gonna go to planks. Modified or regular, you pick. Standard or modified. Hold it for 30 seconds. Looking good, everybody. Elbows are underneath your shoulders. We have two more exercises after this. Okay, back on your backside for some bicycle crunches. Opposite elbow to knee. Remember to go slow and controlled. <clears throat> Last exercise, reverse crunches. Support your lower back. You just bring your knees in towards your face. Last exercise. Rock your butt a little bit off the mat if you can. If this one's too difficult, go back to the front crunch that we started with today. Finish strong, everybody. Finish strong. and relax. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining me for Core and More Beginner Edition. If it was not beginner, hey, that's okay too. All right, if this was difficult, work your way up. Okay, we're all at different spots, but keep pushing yourself, keep making a plan, and keep going strong. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for your time. Coach Doug was saying thank you. Have a great rest of your day. Bye now.